is different. Mm -hmm. I'm talking with Reka Mulliken at Eclectic Gallery. And Reka, you've created a, a number of really wonderful, colorful floor cloths. Can you tell us a little bit about them, what the material is, and how they're sealed, and, mm -hmm. and how you paint them? Well, um, I do start off with uh, a canvas. It's a heavy-duty canvas. <clears throat> and that is then primed from both sides. It's got two coats of prime. Is it gesso? It's a gesso, uh -huh. which is coat, and, coated and does on that both make sides. it waterproof? It makes it waterproof. It doesn't let the it's, and, and the design stays on one side. It just seals the first sealing on the canvas, and then I paint that. I have a background paint, and that's again water based. It's all acrylic. Everything I use is okay. acrylic, right up to the sealant, which is also water based. So it's very environmental friendly. There's no chemicals involved. Wonderful. And and how would one use these cloths? You can use them indoors, starting with your bathroom, your patio. You can use it as your entryway instead of a rug. And they're very easy to wipe down and keep clean. And so they're okay to get wet if somebody has yes. wet feet? You know, you put one in the bathroom. We have one that's been used three years in the bathroom. We come out of a shower and you're walking on it and you just wipe it dry and let it air dry. And it's great because it's sealed on both sides. And the end product. I, I, I'm very interested in the design motifs that you've created for some of these cloths. Yes, they're all different designs. These can be used um, as a sample for a larger piece or as a table runner. And then we can have placemats. So they're just different designs for different... Uh, this could also be done as a large area rug or an outdoor garden cloth. And so are your designs based on nature? Are they yes. based on traditional designs? Uh, a few are based on um, nature and then we do have this one that's more the traditional uh, East Indian design, uh -huh. the background, my background. Yes. And then I've gone on to uh, abstract also. So they're all different designs for different purposes and different requirements, different tastes. So and this is, um, after I've done the, the background paint, I do the drawing. And some of them I do a drawing. And then what's back, an abstract one there that is free for, like it has no design, I just start, it's free form. I just start working and, mm -hmm. and the design develops. And so can you work with a client and um, select colors based on her color theme? Definitely. So, so you would custom make pieces? Yes, for sure. Size, design, color, anything to suit. And they could be anything from um, placemats to... To um, nine by nine pieces full the floor cloths yes. and, and also they can be used in the garden yes yes I've done a few nine by nine and um, and so someone would use them as as a patio cloth yes 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 Wonderful. and you know um, they can be used the whole summer but in winter you'd have to um, 
just give them a wipe, wiping from the top as well as the bottom. See that they clean and then roll them up and put them away. The big pieces, the smaller pieces you can use indoors too in the winter months, but then I roll them and put them away for the winter months because it won't take the real winter, winter, the rain, yes, you know, yes. the extreme rain that we have. But, but certainly for for Summer six, months, six and eight months of the year, you could use them. Definitely. Wonderful. Yes, yes. And I like the idea of putting it in a bathroom. I think that would really uh, enhance the look of a bathroom and, and you certainly... Um, you know, it'd feel great on your feet, particularly in the, in the summer months when you want something cool under the feet. Yes, and the thing was, my first idea to do one for the bathroom was because the bathroom doors, I've been buying rugs for the bathroom from different places and I've always had to go and return them because they're too thick. You don't get the door closed. And I said, this is enough. And I said, I'm going to do something for myself. And that's how I did my first one. And everyone has come and said, wow, that's a great idea. And the door closes, you don't have to worry about. And that was an important factor for me. And many people have said that they haven't been able to find. It is a great idea. And I think it, uh, there are many great ideas here. And I, I love your sense of design as well. I think that that's really an integral part this of each piece. And, and the way that you can uh, keep the attention, they're very active, they're very you know wonderful, but uh, in, on a floor, you can really see how it would fit in in a kitchen floor, or bathroom yes. floor. And this is it's almost like a, a story. It's a script, my own script, abstract script that just goes on, starts that way, <laughs> gets to be a story and just finishes off. That's wonderful. So that's what I've done in this the design here. Thank you very much. Thank that's you too. Thank you.